Hi, my name is Joey Papa. I'm a coffee consultant, and today we're going to learn how to make chocolate coffee. Now, unlike other flavored coffee beverages, when you make chocolate coffee at home, you can make it without adding any calories to your beverage. The way we do this is by using cocoa powder. Now, you can make chocolate coffee in any brewing equipment that you have, but today we're going to be using a French press. If you're not using a French press, but you just want to use a traditional drip coffee cup, a rule of thumb is to use one tablespoon per six cups of coffee. So basically two tablespoons for an entire pot of coffee at home. And all we're going to do is add the cocoa powder to the coffee grounds when you put them in your coffee pot. So today we're going to demonstrate using a French press. We're going to take our coffee, we're going to add it to the French press. Then we're going to add one tablespoon of cocoa powder. We're going to add our water to that. You're going to let it sit for about three to four minutes to allow the cocoa powder as well as the coffee beans to soak in the water. You're then going to take your plunger. You're going to plunge the cocoa and the coffee beans down to the bottom. After you plunge the coffee and push it to the bottom, you can pour it into your coffee cups. You can add cream and sugar or artificial sweetener whatever you prefer, or you could just drink it plain the way that it is. Another idea to make chocolate coffee at home is to use chocolate syrup. Basically, after you just brew your normal cup of coffee, pour it in your cup, add some chocolate syrup, and you have chocolate coffee. Again, my name is Joey Papa. I'm a coffee consultant, and today we learned how to make chocolate coffee.